Serious implications in this contest. Winner advances in the tournament. Loser has to head back to the locker room. Ousted from the event moving forward. Put into the corner now. Boom, right to the midsection. Well scattered reversal there. Swinging the elbow to halt the offense. And he's taking this to the outside now. Moves outside. What's the plan here? He's back into the ring. And Finn Balor connected nicely there. Rocked his opponent. Oh, my goodness. some force on that move. Perhaps thinking about what to do next here. Unmitigate. He goes for the cover. A close two count. Definitely a bad sign for him to almost lose it all right then and there. Oh, he knew what was coming. Finn Balor is an extraordinary athlete. You have to think that will play a part in his strategy here, right, Corey? Finn can literally wrestle circles around anybody. It's why he prefers it when matches go long. As long as Balor doesn't give his opponent too much breathing room, he'll be able to adjust on the fly. Whatever's playing here can't be good. Oh, what a shot to the ear. Look at this, going right after the left arm. Gotta hurt. Making the arm numb makes your opponent very vulnerable. Ooh, right to the arm. Solely focused on punishing the leg. Goes without saying, but a leg injury will hamper your ability to do just about anything. Kick right to the back of the leg. He's lining him up. Look at this! Somersault plancha! That's finding any which way to topple the competition. Hurling your own body like that is insane. Ow! Battling ringside and our announce table's getting shaky. That's because Byron is quivering in fear next to me. Well, I get nervous when the fight comes out here, guys. Targeting the stomach to reverse that maneuver. Oh! And Mahal's in a disheartening spot. Finn wrestling circles around his opponent at this juncture, giving zero breathing room for this guy to formulate a counter strategy. And that was a hell of a maneuver there, guys. Action needs to return to the ring and fast. Well, Jinder Hall has certainly seen better days. Comes back into the ring. Close line. Just a devil-may-care attitude on full display. Going for broke, and it pays off. And he was able to turn that around on Balor. Bang it back with their own counter. Oh, strong impact. Oh. Uh-oh, this is gonna be bad. Really bad. On the table. Reverse DDT through the table. This may have gone too far. Look at this chaos. This is pure destruction. I can barely imagine the damage that the impact caused. I mean, look at what it did to our table. Finds the room to land a back elbow. Mahal tipping the scales a bit here. Here it is, the sling blade. The end is looming now. 
Yeah, not looking good at all. Jinder knows about changing paths in his career. Now he needs to change paths in this match. A drop kick from the middle rope. Nicely done. Extraordinary offense from Balor. Finn is reaching that other level. And it's scouted. Jinder's pushing back now. He isn't allowing that burst of attacks to finish him. Oh, meet the backside of an elbow. Wait a minute, setting in. Devastating submission coming. And now looking to get it locked in. You can see hope for Balor begin to drain away. Finn Balor, nowhere to go, nowhere to hide. Oh, man, that was a thing of beauty. Right into a snapmare. with a swift elbow to the gut. Uh-oh. Finn turns it around. What a forearm. And Mahal's in a disheartening spot. But the Maharaja's always just one move away from changing everything. And attacking above the shoulders has become the strategy here. The drop kick to follow. I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. Oh, he's in the drop zone. Coup de grace. Did Balor secure a win? Cover. There's two. Guys, he put him away. That's a pretty big win. A lot of good action in that one. Here's another look. for Finn Balor. Balor Club rejoice. Your leader has emerged victorious.